it's another mat day here with teacher jenny join me for another topic this time we are going to talk about how to compute your grade in a 25 50 25 grading system so 25 percent here is for your written work and then 50 percent for pt and 25 percent for quarterly assessment so let's start with the following grades now, if you've got written work scores such as 28 over 30, 25 over 30, and 22 over 30, and we are on 25% on this. And then if you've got performance task, which is 50 over 50, 45 over 50, and 44 over 50, under 50% component. And for the mastery test and quarterly test, uh, you've got 40 over 60 and 38 over 60 in a 25% component. So let us try to compute that one. So how do we compute our uh, scores or grade for the following scores under 25, 50%, 25% component of your grade? So let's start by adding our uh, written scores or written work scores. So we've got there 28, and then we have plus 25, and then we have also 22. So adding those scores, that will be equal to 75. So for the written work, you've got 75 as your row score, and then with a total of, so this will be now the total, on written work number one, we've got 30 points all in all. And then we've got also 30 on the second written work. And we've got also 30 on the third, adding that one that's equal to 90. So you've got all in all on the written work, 75 over 90. So what we are going to do here is we will be dividing the two and then we will be multiplying that one by our 25% or the 0.25. So again, we'll be dividing our 75 by the total score, which is 90. And then multiplying that one by 0.25 for our 25%. And then we are multiplying that again by 100% to convert that one into a percentage. So that will be now 20.83. So let's try to round it off until 100's place. Now next, we go for computing for our performance task. So performance task here, we've got um, 50 for the first one, then 45, and then the next one is 44. Adding that one, we've got 50 plus 45 plus 44, that will be equal to 139. That's your raw score for the performance task. And then we are going to add up the total for the performance task. Uh, 50 is for the first one, and another one is another 50, and another one is another 50. That's a, do a total of 150. So computing our performance task again, we will be doing that one as 139 over 150 times the component of this one is 50%. So we have that one as 0 0.50 or 0.5. Then again, we'll be multiplying that by 100% to get the percentage. So we have 139 divided by 150 and then times 0 0.5 times 100 and that's equal to 46 0.33. Okay, next up, we go for the quarterly assessment. First, on the mastery, we've got 40. And then on the quarterly, we've got 38 for that one, adding that one that's 78. And then the total for that one is 60 on the mastery, and quarterly is another 60. Adding that one again, that will be equal to 120. So computing for that one, we've got 78 out of 120, multiplying that by the component, which is 0.25, and multiplying that one again by 100%. So 
So we've got 78 divided by 120 times 0.25 and times 100. That will be equal to 16.25. Now this time, we will be adding all of the scores, I mean all of the result here. So we've got 20.83 plus 46.33 plus 16.25, that will be equal to 83. So let me write it here. So you've got there a total of 83.41. Now this time we will be going to do uh, search that over on our transmutation table. This is not yet your grade, your actual grade. You will be going to transmit that one in this transmutation table. So we'll go for locating 83.41 on this column here, this one. So starting off with that one. So we've got 83, so we'll be locating on the second column. So we've got 83 here around this corner. So we have 83.41. So for 83.41, that falls under this range from 82.40 to 83.99. Again, this is our lower and upper um, range on that particular grade in which the equivalent of that one is 89. So your grade will be 89 under the grade component 25%, 50%, 25%. So this will be your final grade. I hope that helps out. And, and again, always remember that grade doesn't define who you are. Thank you for watching.